Hey, sweetheart. Did not see you there. I'll put this down. When did you get home? Well, I'm glad to have you here. Did you have a good day at least? Good. I know you had been a bit stressed out earlier with all the meetings you had and I knew I had that one phone call that was a little uh, frightening, so I'm glad everything went well. You'll have to tell me all about it later. My day was good. No uh, complaints or anything like that. So just been kind of tidying up and getting ready to unwind and relax. I was thinking we could maybe watch that new Netflix special. Yeah. I've lost track. I know there's so many with like catfishing and falling in love with a criminal and things like that, but they do a good job making them, so I'm excited to watch. Did you eat and everything as well? I had something as well. I just didn't uh, want to forget about you in case you didn't get a chance to eat. Since you've had such a stressful, stressful, such a stressful day, I was thinking that I could maybe give you a little Well, you do so much work with your hands and they gotta be kind of sore and tired after a long day's work so I figured one of my I guess infamous maybe not the right word one of my special hand massages with some essential oils and lotion will help your hands kind of unwind as well while we're watching the show Sound good to you? Okay, good. So, I have quite a few oils. I don't know if there was any scent you had in mind. I know you enjoy this French lavender. French, French, French lavender body oil. massages, hand massages. I sometimes even like to put a drop or two on the scalp just to help with the um, relaxation, I guess. And lavender is notorious for being a relaxing scent. oils that we can use. Now some of them I would recommend I'd recommend steering clear of um, as some are for motivating and energizing. So we want to relax and unwind or at least I assume you would want to unwind to relax. But whatever you want to do. So if 
there's any that sound appealing to you. Um, if you are trying to do more of a calming, we could do frankincense. Frankincense, frankincense. We could do frankincense, which is soothing. of a spa ambiance, which you may want to try. Here. me of some like tried and gum but it's a good scent. Yeah you like that one okay. Are there any others you want to smell before we move on with the actual massage? The only other one I might want to suggest is lemongrass. Lemongrass lemongrass says Lemongrass has been shown to deter insects, ward off germs, and most importantly, soothe an overactive mind. An overactive, an overactive mind, which you tend to have sometimes. do is I'll do the massage with the oil first and then I'll add a little bit of some lotion that I have to the side here. Do you want me to grab you anything before we get started? My hands are going to be a little um, oily and so will yours be. <laughs> so anything to drink, any snacks, I figured I would pop some popcorn before uh, we start watching Netflix, so you can wait, okay? <laughs> I usually cannot, so. Alright, so if you want to just put your hands down right there. have some tense hands. You work too hard in my opinion. Here. I'm just gonna need right in the bottom. Let me know if I hurt you. I know you tend to have a high pain tolerance, but a more here. Great way to end your day. 
know I should cash in on some hand massages myself. I've, you've done them before. I know you uh, can do it. Can't pretend. and soothe yet. <laughs> I'm gonna smell like gum for days. Do you have any thoughts on what you wanted to do for dinner tomorrow? No, I wasn't really thinking anything in particular. I just, again, I know you've had a really, really busy week and I thought I would make something that you enjoy. Did you maybe want to do, like, steak? We could do, like, a surf and turf with some Lobster. Or we could even do like a burger. I know you're not super picky when it comes to food, which is what I like about you. Still doing all right, not hurting you. And then remind me tomorrow. I'm gonna go grab um, that beer. You like that craft beer? When I went into the store last week, they were out. And I spoke to Frank, the manager. Not in like a um, Karen way. I know sometimes I'm a little impatient, but nothing like that. More so just inquiring when the next shipment will be coming in. And they told me that it would be tomorrow. So I put in a deposit to have them hold a six pack for us. I know we don't get to uh, enjoy it often, it's hard to find, so any opportunity I can find or can get some, I'm gonna do it. It was after all the beer we had on our first date. Yeah, it was the first time we both had tried it, so I think it's a fun little tradition. How's that feeling? Are you soothed in the peppermint gum scent? <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> kidding. But what I'm not kidding about is moisturizing your hands because they are dry. <laughs> and they're both Luckily, this is for skin relief. Um, moisturizing helps heal very dry skin, which you unfortunately have right now. Unfortunately, oils, some can have some aloe and some moisturizing ingredients. These oils do not, unfortunately. 
unfortunately, so I have to do a little double duty. It just means a double massage. This one is fragrance free, so we're not going to be mixing any scents to make it a little overwhelming and overpowering. We don't want to make it overwhelming and overpowering. So, just grab a little. Okay. Get a little more. Okay. I'm just going to rub that into my hands. I won't put a ton on. I know you do not like when your hands are super greasy. Do you remember that one time that we uh, went bowling? And you put on some hand lotion right before we went. Yeah, it was a double date with my friend Sam. Yeah. And you, um, and just slipped. That ball went flying backwards. It actually, I think, knocked into someone, didn't it? Or am I missing that? I might be confusing that. Not that I experience a lot of um, bowling accidents, but... So we've learned our lesson. Do not moisturize. Things like a bowling ball. I think that was one of your best games, though, despite that. Yeah. I think you almost bowled a 200. And I almost bowled a 20. <laughs> it's crazy. I still need the bumpers, otherwise it's just gutter balls. That's also why I don't bowl. Or I try to avoid it. Should do it. Let's see here. Give me a minute. No, I don't want to go bowling this weekend. <laughs> Thank you, though. your hands feel so much better with a little bit of moisturizer. I know. I'm never wrong. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm hoping you feel more relaxed right now. Good. Okay. Glad I could help. And you know what will help even more? Some Netflix some trashy docu-series and some popcorn extra butter extra salt <laughs> and a big glass of water of course okay well if you want to go get the movie started or the series I don't even know anymore I will go get the popcorn popping and we can enjoy our rest of our night See you in a bit.